Okay, now we're talking about finding solutions to a system of ordinary differential equations with constant coefficients whose eigenvalues are complex. Okay, let's take a look at this. Um, let lambda 1 be that complex variable. I do need to remind you that um, if a solution to a characteristic equation or any polynomial is complex, then its complex conjugate is also a solution to that equation. So, um, two for one on this one. Yes, be a complex eigenvalue of the coefficient matrix A, and we're going to let B1 be the real part of my eigenvalue associated with that eigenvector, and B2 is going to be the imaginary part of my eigenvector that's associated with that eigenvalue, then two solutions arise. x1 is the real part times the cosine of oh, beta, right, the imaginary part of my eigenvalue, minus b2 times the sine of that very same beta, t e to the alpha real part, t. And the other solution b2 coming from the conjugate is going to be the imaginary part of the eigenvector times the cosine of the imaginary part of the eigenvalue plus the real part of the eigenvector times the sine of the imaginary part of the eigenvector no nope, value e to the real part t Okay. All right. Why don't we solve one of these? Okay. I'm up here with this system. Hmm. Seems pretty real. Hmm. Mm -mm. Okay. So I transform it into its characteristic matrices. Yeah. Um. I take the determinant and I find my characteristic equation is going to be lambda squared minus eight lambda plus seventeen. Okay. I look for the factors of seventeen that add to be eight. Find that there aren't any. So then I go quadratic on it. So then now that I'm all quadratic on it, I find that my lambda values are going to be 4 plus or minus i. So then take it up here. Right. You knew they were going to be complex conjugates anyway. So then I'm going to take the positive one. I put it into my characteristic matrix, augment it with 0. Great. So now I'm trying to reduce using um, row operations. So I need to ask myself, what do I multiply? 2 minus i by to get minus 5, so that when I add them, um, it's going to eliminate this guy. Hmm. Okay. So then I find that I divide by 2 minus i. Okay. Rationalize that denominator. Multiply by its conju complex conjugate. And minus 5 times the numerator over. Here I use the sum of squares, and that's 5. I reduce, and I find my x value is going to be that guy. <clears throat> so I went ahead and I took the liberties of multiplying in there. I knew this times 2 minus i was going to be a minus 5, and then times the minus 1 was a 2i. And then when I added them, I wiped them out. Awesome. That leaves me with this equation up here. Mm, yeah. Uh-huh. E, okay, so we have this relationship. 2 plus i, y, is 5x. So then I'm going to make a choice, choice for my y. I'm going to let y be 5. Why? Because then when I divide by 5, I'm going to be left with 2 plus i. So then my eigenvalue for 4 plus i, my eigenvector for 4 plus i, is going to be, uh, yeah, 2 plus i and 5. I break it up into its real and imaginary parts. Yeah. And then I designate the real part as B1 and the imaginary part as B2. And I know my forms because my um, first solution is going to be the real part cosine angle mm -hmm, plus oh, minus my imaginary part sine angle E to the real part. Yes. So I'm going to plug them on in. It's pretty much routine, like a ground ball after here. Um, 2, 5 goes with the real part, cosine of 1t. Why? Because my value, or my 
Yeah, eigenvalue was four plus i, making this the real part. Alpha is four, and this, the imaginary part, beta is one. So then that's, that's, that's why I got to replace beta with one. And then minus the imaginary vector, sine 1t, e to the 4t, march it on out. Yeah, the four was there because that was my real part of my eigenvalue. So now I do the same thing for equation two. Mm -hmm. Notice I'm switching my vectors. Yeah, my real and imaginary. All right, the derivation of these things isn't too bad. Um, so then I'm finally down here. Yeah, I have x is equal to c1x1 plus c2x2. That's a general solution. Yeah, okay. So then I plug it all in. I plug it all in. Great. It's all done, but the, the box. I don't know. What is that? Okay. Just a standard flat.